gonna need a marble notebook, some scrap of paper, Mod Podge chalkboard paint, if he's any color, I'm using blue, some sponge applicators, uh, washi tape, and scissors. But I'm using a paper cutter because it's much easier. So let's get started. Baboosh! <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. So let's start with the front cover. He wants to get. So what you want to do is get your scrap of paper and line up on the front cover along the edge of the black tape and fold the top and bottom edges towards the inside of the front cover like so. What you want to do is go ahead and with that big space on the left side is just fold it towards the um, inside leaving about an inch space as you can see. Now you want to just go ahead flip it over and uh, make that edge crease you see there. For the other edge yeah so yeah <laughs> now we have that spine like sh shape now we're gonna go ahead and cut it um you want to make sure it fits once again and you're just gonna cut that for only the first crease you made towards the inside you don't need the excess paper store that way and now it's time to glue the paper make sure again it fits the cover and you want to do is take some mod podge and just sprinkle some or squiggle some on the cover like so And then what you want to do is evenly spread it across the book. Make sure you get every corner, every side, except for the black part. And you're going to apply the um, paper on top of it. You want to do it slowly so there's no ear bubbles. And yeah. You want to do the same thing with the inside flaps as well. And now that you're done with that, you want to add some Mod Podge on top of the cover and on top of the flaps to make that kind of, oh, I just bought it out of a store feeling. Now it's time to apply the chalkboard paint. Now you want to do is get some washi tape and put it along the edges of each flap, just like so. And then take your chalkboard paint and just randomly put it on the center of the cover and evenly spread it across. You want to do at least three layers of this and make sure it dries between each layer. Now it's time to remove the tape and I'm actually going to apply more Mod Podge to the edges because some of the paper came off and I hopefully, hopefully you guys understand me during this first part of this tutorial. Time for the fun part, the initial chalkboard back. Yes guys, this means you are a personalized person, you are creative. And basically what you want to do is take some washi tape and spell out the first letter of your first and last name, aka your initials. My name is Sharon Lignanoff, so my first name starts with C, last name with M, spell not C, M. And once you're done with that, you want to take a chalkboard paint, to take any color you want. I'm going to use the same thing since I have the same color, you know, I'm going to use it out. And we're going to just have fun with this, swirl around and spread it evenly. Make sure you don't get it on the um, black tape, but if you want it on the black tape, tape go ahead and remember you want to do three layers and yeah now time for the removal part yay i'm actually i'm actually going to remove this while it's still wet because I, I saw some air bubbles during the tape part when i applied the um chalkboard paint so i'm going to clean up the errors and yeah once, once you're, you're done with that you want to go ahead and take some stock paper and we're going to go ahead and make the tag of the cover. So when it measure out on the cover, I mean, the measurement is all about you. And, I mean, you don't have to put a tag on it, but you could if you want. I want to take at least an inch of stock paper, measure it out, cut it, and cut the corners, and write Spanish on them with colorful markers because I'm a colorful girl. And also, Spanish, I usually use marble notebooks for Spanish, I don't know why. So we use black mark to outline it and use some tape to tape it on the cover. And once you're done with that, you're done with everything. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. It's my first back to school video. Speaking of back to school tomorrow, it's back to school. I'm so nervous. And what I like about this, like this idea is that your initials are in the back and I'm starting to do this before. And I just love it. And you can write some notes to your friends in the, in the front cover on your chalkboard. Because I know people get caught using posting notes. So chalkboard is the best idea. And um, yeah. And you can use this book for your favorite subjects as well. For me it's drama. And yeah. I just love it. It's the best idea. You know. And it's personalized. So you can make it however you like. And yeah. So I hope you like this video guys. Please. 
please click here to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and hit that like button guess we'll go up to charlie 150 likes yes so hit the like button 150 likes and i'll see you guys later as always love you guys and see you guys later like i said bye